Good day and welcome back to another episode of the Vuvuzela. Today we're in sunny Salt Rock at Miasai and we're going to be interviewing Shane Sykes. Hi Shane, how are you doing? How's it going? Yeah, thanks for being here and uh, yeah, stoked to be back open since the lockdown and um, yeah, keen to chat. Cool. Shane, tell us about the name Miasai, it's an unusual name. Um, yeah, I mean, I came up with it kind of just because uh, the acai berry is, is a different kind of, if you look at it, look at the word, it's kind of like a catchy, you look at it and you try like think to yourself, how, well, how do you say that in a way? And um, also with me means like ocean in Latin and my life revolves a lot around the ocean and um, obviously being healthy and um, yeah, just loving the actual fruit that is called the acai berry. And so that's kind of where the name came about. And um, yeah. So tell us a little bit more about your superfood bar, cafe. Um, yeah, well, we've been open for like a year and a half now. And yeah, it's been going really well. Kind of every everything that came about, like it all kind of happened fast at the start. And now it's all just kind of coming together really well. And we're getting like a good community um, base where you have your regular customers and yeah it's just um it's it's a different kind of thing to have like you don't really have this around um this area and um yeah i got i got the idea from traveling overseas when i was competing um at some surf events and that in australia hawaii and like california and that and the acai berry actually comes from the amazon so like brazil area and that's where it's native to and um, so it's quite a process getting the, the acai berry and that all back back to South Africa because the way it has to be harvested and then sent to Australia and then to us and it's quite a big process but at the end of the day it's worth it for for the taste so yeah um, that's kind of like a short story of us. <laughs> Shane you're a professional surfer you share a space with the Salt Rock Surf Shop tell us a little bit more about how that works hand in hand? Um, yeah, well, kind of last year or the start of last year, I, I got onto Channel Island surfboards, which um, which is like has been a dream of mine since I was younger. And at the time, they were they were looking at getting a space to have like a showroom for boards. And then I, I spoke to them about my idea for for like this because I was going to start in a trailer. And then they were like, no ways, like, let's get together and, and um, kind of share the space and make like a little vibe kind of thing. And um, yeah, and after like a month of talking about it, it just ended up happening like so quickly. And then now, you know, now it's actually um, called the Salt Rock Surf Shop, run by Guy and Barry Campbell. And um, yeah, really cool guys. And if you need help with boards or any accessories, they can help you with that. And it's kind of just a cool aspect, you know, like if you're coming from a surf and you're hungry, you can come here. Or if you need something for your surfboard or whatever, you can come here and get it and then vice versa. You know, it just, it just works really well together. Shane, you have a wide variety of superfoods on your menu. Tell us a little bit more perhaps about the OG bowl. What is that about? Yeah, well, the OG bowl is kind of like a OG stands for original. So pretty much everywhere I went overseas, they would have a bowl called, not called the OG bowl, but something along the lines of like the go-to kind of like, that's the one um, without all the extra toppings and that like, that's the one you'll get on any given day. If, um, if you go to some sort of a side bar, like they're gonna have that exact one where it's just uh, blended with banana, acai, um, frozen strawberries, fr frozen blueberries, and then obviously, and then blended with coconut water. And then we top it with fresh strawberry, blueberry, and then uh, Stone Lodge granola, and, and then some coconut shavings and that. And then, so that's why it's kind of like the original, because it's not filled with too much stuff, but it's just like simple and yeah, easy. Awesome, it sounds absolutely delicious. It sounds like you're gearing up these surfers to, to go surfing 
for hours with the right superfood into their bodies. Yeah, for sure. I mean, I definitely feel like if I surf and I come back here and have a smoothie, I feel like I can go have another three hour surf straight away. It's like, I don't know if it's just me, or, but I definitely feel the difference for sure. Thank you, Shane. It's been an absolute treat interviewing you today. I love your energy. Good luck going forward. Cool. Thanks so much. And to the viewers out there, thank you for joining us for another episode of The Vuvuzela. Remember to follow us on our social media channels and visit our website. Thank you. Until next time.